This is Banjo, and today I'm going over how to perform a crank start in the Camo 50, which can be used to solve startup problems due to a flooded engine. As we're able to see, when I throw the left cutoff valve at 2000 RPM, normally the RPM spikes up to operating levels. Though, if you let it wait too long before throwing the cutoff valve, you'll flood the engine. At this point, to solve the flooded engine, the first thing we're going to do is shut off the cutoff valve and shut down the engine start cycle. Then we're going to wait for RPM to zero out at zero RPM. As we're able to see below the start button, we have a selector switch for start, crank, and false. We're going to set it into the crank start position, which will essentially turn the engine without supplying more fuel, which will allow it to burn out the fuel that's already in the lines. So at this point, we're going to engage the rotor brake since we don't currently have a running engine. This isn't a necessary step, but it's a step you can take. And at this point, we're going to hit engine start once RPM hits zero. The engine start cycle light will appear. RPM will reach up to 2200 RPM, and it will hold it for about a minute and a half before shutting down. The crank start is finished when the engine start cycle light extinguishes and RPM returns to zero RPM. At this point you can perform another crank start if needed. In this example I do perform two, although I only demonstrate the one, as it can take a couple of crank starts to burn out all of the excess fuel. So at this point I'll disengage the rotor brake, set the selector into normal start, and start the engine as I normally would. Once RPM reaches 2000 RPM I'll throw the cutoff valve for the respective engine, engine gas temperature will spike, and the engine will start up as it normally would. If the engine start cycle light doesn't come on when you initiate the crank start or the RPM doesn't reach 2000 RPM, you will have bigger problems than simply a flooded engine and likely have to request a repair.